Hello everyone, welcome to MP channel. Today, uh, special, I, I, I want to show you how to configure basic voice using CME router Cisco router express. I have this router here. I'm gonna show you something uh, something interesting here. This is my router, Cisco 2821, supporting voice, and I have here switch, small business, POE of course, and I have two phones here, Cisco 7. Uh, 7941 and 7961 okay how to do how to connect uh, the cables between them it's easy first you have this is my router here this is my router this is cable from giga 00, zero to switch here connect it directly and of course two cables to the phones this is one and this is the last one here to this phone and uh, you don't have to do a configuration on the switch because uh, I want to do basic one not advanced and this is my console cable connected directly to my PC so let's start with the configuration okay guys so let's start with the configuration uh, I'm I am not uh, gonna use uh, two DHCP pool because I use only phone I don't need for the IP for P my PC so I'm gonna show you here first you should create DHCP pool Name it uh, voice network one nine two one six eight dot one dot zero your network here with two five five slash twenty four create default router here it's gonna be one dot one IB of my router interface giga zero zero um DNS server if you have DNS server I'm gonna use Google also option 150 and type IB address here 192.168.1.1 here my configuration I did it before so if you want to see it again this is the configuration of the HCP pool here cool now go to telephony surface create new one here first you should type this command no auto e phone register I don't want uh, router register a phone or Cisco IP phones directly no I want to do it manually not automatically so this is the first command uh, second create CNA files mm, okay uh, we are gonna uh, type this command later max DN extension numbers how many you have I'm gonna type 4 max e phone 3 for example now create cn files here we go cn files post uh, per phone cool uh, ib source is gonna be the cme router and it's gonna be my router here 1.1 .1 with port 2000 
like this cool uh, that's it basic uh, commands here you can uh, you, ha you can type this command system message the company name uh, like uh, I'm gonna name it here uh, Google company I'm gonna show it to you where it will be on the phone uh, that's it exit here if you want to see the configuration here I'm gonna show you max e phone max dn ip source cn files per phone uh, create cn files and system message here first uh, I didn't check my IP is here show IP interface brief oh giga zero zero okay interface giga zero one no IP address interface giga zero zero IP address here one dot one with slash twenty four and no shutdown to make sure okay now to type this command again do show IP interface brief okay cool uh, after the after we configure telephone surfaces now here there should be server okay one to two here oh, I should uh, maximize this okay cool now create e phone and dn e phone number and e phone extension numbers first i'm gonna create extension numbers this is the first one here name it uh number is gonna be one 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 like this name the employee um i'm gonna name it here uh, Mm. Ali and the label on the phone is gonna be same Ali like this cool now create another DN number is gonna be 112 label uh, John name same John. now we are done from the extension numbers the next step is e phone one now you should first type the MAC address for each phone MAC address for the first phone 0022 dot let's show this phone here and 9005 dot seven c e e seven c e e cool type the phone the number is seven nine six one oh sorry not six four six one uh and the button button it means the button on the phone first uh for example for my phone here 7961 I have six buttons the first button is gonna be number one and the the next number here is gonna be the e phone DN I have here two DN choose one of them this one or this one I'm gonna use this one for e phone one cool last thing you should do is restart okay now for the second phone e phone 2 mac address 0024 dot c4 pd dot 4 ff0 cool 
uh, after MAC address type the number of the phone 7941 here uh, and put on one first button on the phone with DN number 2 because DN number 1 is already assigned to e phone 1 so I'm gonna use the e phone DN number 2 here and type restart after we configure the two phones here you should save the commands by doing the right command or safe running configuration startup configuration if also you should use the PC to get IP address from DHCP server you should create two DHCP pool first pool is gonna be for the PC the second pool is gonna be for the fonts and we should configure the switch to get to DHCP pool for the fonts and the PC but this time I did the basic configuration for fonts uh, later in the next video maybe I will configure phones with PC to get IP address from DHCP pool uh, okay if there is anything here I will show you the show run here this is DHCP pool voice this is for the phones here and if you want to to get uh, IP address for the PC you should create another DHCP pool uh, okay, I'm gonna show you this is the telephone surfaces here. This is e phone DN, e phone DN2, e phone 1, and e phone 2. Uh, second thing you should know that you should have the files for the each phone. This is the my iOS here, and this is the all files here is for the phones. If you don't have these uh, files the uh, your phone will not work after i configure the e phone one and e phone two uh, here we go this is john and this is ali and google company here message and this is google company let's start dial one 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 and here we go you can answer from here like this and end call here also here let's dial 112 dial and here we go same here and call this is this files uh, are for Phone, IB phone 7941 to 7961 uh, that's it if you like this video share subscribe like and comment until next time see ya